we met Silverio back in November of 2021. Uh, we all evaluated him, our multidisciplinary team here, including myself and a physical therapist. We learned uh, that he had a stroke several years prior and he did not feel that he was going to improve. Sometimes people that have strokes, heart issues, other problems, things that, you know, they're not gonna progress with therapy. In pace, you, you can. You follow the step, you follow our therapist, and get all those classes, and you'll see the progress. And one of the big examples for our participants is Silverio. Silverio had a stroke in uh, 2017. Uh, most of the time, for two years, he was with um, his son. Uh, they were not able to take care of him anymore, so I took over. Um, but he was in really bad condition with no uh, medical uh, treatment or no physical treatment or anything like that. I did have a good feeling that we could make some improvements because um, the muscles in his right side were still active. He's now able to do all of his ADLs independently. So he's getting dressed by himself. Um, he's showering by himself. He is, you know, doing all these things without assistance anymore because he's now able to use his arm. The activity that he's doing here at the at Pace, uh, it's been helping him to have a more of a social life, including with his own family. All the, all the neighborhood help, uh, and staff, uh, Silverio is totally grateful to them, myself. Um, we, we couldn't, I couldn't have done it without them. 